All right, guys, how's it going? This is an indie game on the Xbox Live Arcade called Cute Things Dying Violently. Um, it is 80 Microsoft points, which is $1. Uh, I want to take you through a couple of levels and show you the basic gist of this game so you can see what it's like. Trust me, it is very fun, and it is very violent. So <laughs> let's hop in to one of the maps here, or one of the levels, and... Uh, you can see these little messages. It just uh, whenever you uh, come into something new, it you know gives you uh, a tutorial on it. So you've got these little guys down here walking across, and I've got my little indicator. So the whole point behind this game is to get those guys into this elevator that is above my indicator right now, and you do that by flicking them around. Um, you uh, hold down your right stick to a certain extent, and it throws them based on how far you have it thrown back. It's kind of like a slingshot type of thing. And you can grab them with the uh, the left trigger. Hold on, let me let me turn off my notification so it doesn't get in the way. I hate when I forget to do that. Voice no. Okay. Let's uh, continue. All right, so I've got them grabbed. So I want to throw them up onto that button there, but not too hard because you can see the chainsaws. Uh, are the saw blades? It's not a chainsaw, but um, they once they hit them, they die, and it is very gruesome shit. It is not for the weak at heart. <laughs> so let's try to get this just right, okay? And now this last one. Ah, okay. He did not die. That is good. <laughs> so to unlock levels, you have to save. Um, uh, a total amount of critters, so it doesn't, you don't have to save all of them uh, in one map, you can just save uh, different amounts in each map, but you have to reach a certain total in order to unlock a new level. I don't know why I threw them back up there, so now I just need to throw them up to the elevator. And you know what, for good measure, I'm just going to throw one into the saw blades so <laughs> you can see just how gruesome their deaths are. <laughs> okay. Let's go do another level. Alright, so let's see what this says. These guys have buttons, the constant pressure to keep things activated. Hold a critter, a critter on it so you can send a different critter to access the yellow button and open the elevator. So this needs constant pressure on it. Let's see. Yeah, so that keeps it open. Alright, so I've got him sitting on that. I guess I just need to throw them all the way over. Oh no! Oh, that is not good. Okay, there we go. Right there. Nice. Alright, now he's gonna come down. <laughs> that guy looks so bad up there. That was very gruesome shit. <laughs> okay. Now, along the game, you'll, uh, you know, with indie games, you don't have actual achievements that you unlock for your Xbox Live account. But on this game, uh, you have something called achievements. It's two different words. So you unlock those, and you hit right trigger to go to the uh, to the special levels, and you can do different levels that I'm pretty sure are all based on just being a murderous bastard. So I've got one of them unlocked, and I am going to go through that with you right now. Uh, so it's see how quickly you can bloody up every buzzsaw in the level. And the timer will begin when the first bus saw is hit, and I have infinite critters. So, let's go ahead and set up for the first bus saw, and try to hit all of the bus saws in this level. No, that's not gonna work. There we go, there we go. Ah, uh, no. Up there. Ah, oh, damn it. Okay, I got one. <laughs> Damn it, I keep bouncing. I need to do it a little up. Oh. Still bouncing. Stop bouncing. Come on, you gotta just miss that. Damn it! Come on, bro. I cannot get this right. I keep bouncing off of that damn thing. There we go. <laughs> this is so mean. 
Okay, that one. Come on. Get over there. Come on. I cannot get this right. <laughs> Let's just start tossing him. Fuck it. All right, bro. All right, that one's going to go into that saw blade. And then that should be... Oh, come on. This bouncing nonsense that I keep doing. There we go. All right. <laughs> Oh, all right, guys. So now that you have seen some of those levels, maybe that'll give you a uh, a sense of the game. Maybe you'll want to buy it. Uh, and you have uh, these little bosses in between that I've seen. They're like big robots that say hate on them. So you've got to destroy them when you get to those. But this game, from what I've seen, does get pretty hard down the road, so I'm sure it is worth your dollar. So uh, that is it for this game, and I will see you guys later.